Um, what I'm eating for the day. So to start off, I break my fast. I'm probably be breaking my fast about eight o'clock. I'm just running around the kitchen, and I just got in from Pilates, so I'm having some salmon. This is about uh, ten ounces. Um, I have a lot of protein to get, and I normally don't get in all the protein that I should. So this is ten ounces of salmon. Um, this is a cup of a big sweet potato. I put a little bit of butter in here, uh, cinnamon, and some homemade vanilla uh, flavor. I'm going to break my fast with this um, fruit cup. This is a medium-sized banana with a yellow dragon fruit and a whole navel um, orange. And then over here, I have like a greens medley with some broccolini. Uh, collard greens and a little cabbage and um, I season my food hold on I season all my food and my meats with this adobe with adobo adobe adobo season I get this from sprouts and it has just the right amount of like salt and then um, garlic and onion powder and black pepper so this is everything that it has in it and it's just enough I didn't put anything in this because you know uh, collard greens and cabbage makes its own liquid so probably at the end I may put a tad bit of uh, extra virgin olive oil and I use this brand right here then for my final meal of the night these are garlic parmesan chicken breast tenders I get from sprouts so I probably do just two of these which equals to about six to seven ounces and then I'll do um, two cups of this right here and that would be all for my second meal. And then um, I will probably do, if I'm still hungry, a, um, a, a fruit, a protein fruit smoothie. So for my protein fruit smoothie, I use this right here, um, Sun Warrior Protein Classic Plus Vanilla. Um, this is a plant-based, I believe. And these are the, um, supplement facts right here everything that's in it and I use one scoop and it comes with a scooper right here and then this is what it looks like this runs about $25 or something like that I get it from sprouts as well then I have my um, frozen strawberries and then my frozen bananas and so sometimes I even will do um, some frozen blueberries. I freeze all of my fruit for my smoothie so I won't have to use ice. Um, sometimes I use um, a little bit of ice in my pro my smoothies. And normally I would use like, because I split these up, so I use like two to four pieces of banana. So I just wanted to show you to the, um, I cannot do a salad without salad dressing, so I really like this salad dressing. It's low in calories and fat, and it tastes really good. So this is the uh, information on it. So for two tablespoons, it's 50 calories, four and a half grams of fat, two grams of carbs, no sugars. Um, the ingredients are straightforward, pretty much. It's certified organic. And they have like three or four different kinds, but I like this one the best. I do like yogurt-based uh, salad dressings. I've never tried these before, so I'm gonna put some of this on my um, salad. I got these from Safeway. And again, it's, you know, very little calories, one gram of fat, six grams of carbs. You only need a little bit information. They're little bite size. I haven't opened them yet. And then I do do a dessert and I factor these into my um, macros or calories or nutrients. And these little cakes are pretty good. I get them from uh, Sprouts. And so I do one little cupcake. Again, um, everything is factored in to my macros and if it doesn't fit then I don't eat it so the calories on this one is 230 uh, 10 grams of fat 
no trans fat, um, 33 grams of carbs, which my carb intake is high. Um, and I sometimes haven't reached that either. Only um, since I've gotten my macros done, I, I should be taking in on my workout days like 202 grams of carbs, but um, I don't do much carbs like rice and potatoes once in a while i do a baked sweet potato but other than that i mostly get my carbs from my vegetables and i do a lot of broccolini um yellow squash so and these little cupcakes are good too and this is the chocolate one and um this is the ingredient the nutrients facts on the chocolate one so like i said when i do my snacks i factor everything into my macros and everything and then i got these from sprouts too and it comes with the nutrition facts so one cookie is 140 calories five grams of fat which is not bad and all i need is one and then i choose some um, sugar-free gum if i still have a sugar craving i drink soda maybe once or twice a week and that's on the weekends or maybe a friday night but other than that i just drink my water so um that's all i got for you so uh thank you for watching if you have any questions dialogue you know hit me up in the comments subscribe if you haven't hit that notification button i'm trying to upload a little bit more regularly these days and Peace out.